Agent McCabe? Jerry. What, what the hell are you doing? Oh, just getting rid of a few things I don't need. Like this desk, this radio, this office. What, are you heading back to Sacramento? Yeah. I don't know how long I'm going to be there, not after today. Sir, look, you know, we all know what you, what you did and finding the witness for the defense and all. You got something to say about that? No way. Good. I haven't exactly made that many friends since I've been here. I can't argue with that. But you know what the bottom line is? Reese and Jody Walker are, are very special people to us here. And what you did for BJ took a hell of a lot of guts. We really admire you for it. Thanks, Jerry. I appreciate that. It means a lot to me. Agent McCabe, why'd you do it? Well, someone showed me that loyalty to an institution doesn't mean that you give up loyalty to yourself. When I first came here, it was me against everybody, and I was going to beat them all. Until I saw someone else's neuroses about winning at any cost. I don't know, I guess it kind of woke me up. You're talking about Ben Arnold, aren't you? Yeah, he once told me that I was a lot like him. That's a scary thought. Considering he's an early candidate for a heart attack. I'm not ready for that. Anyway, I'm gonna leave you something. Pearls of wisdom, sir? No. <laughs> this jar of jelly beans. Under one condition, though. What's that? That you always stay true to yourself. Above all the rest. You got a deal. Jerry? You take care of yourself. Good luck, Connor. All the best to you. Yep. <laughs>